Humanoid Nation. So I just saw Wonder Woman yesterday. It was a lit movie. God damn, Gal Gadot is so fine, just so fine. And speaking of Wonder Woman, this video is by SK Anbu. It's called Behind the Story of Wonder Woman. All right, let's get to it. I'd like to hear more about Wonder Woman. I don't know that much about her, but let's get to it. Let's full screen this and let's do this shit. Hello guys. Welcome with me, Eskan Boo, Teenager Watts and Boo. In this channel, I want to talk about behind the story anything. What? This time, I want to tell a story about a Wonder Woman. In this video, I will provide knowledge about the inception of Bam! until now. Just had to. I hope this Just, video yes, can insight about the Wonder Woman. So let's begin. Excellent movie yesterday. Excellent movie. One year later, in 1940, except for the guy who played Ares at the very end, overacted the shit out of it. A member but that's my of only the problem about it. Comic, a Justice Society. Justice Jay Society Garrick. is a superhero team created by DC Comics. When viewed this hero team that remind me the engine of Greek culture about Zeus, Athena and Hades. Hades. If in India Hades. there is a Shiva, Brahman and Krishna, the power of God. We've been messing with our minds. Great. How do we fight it? We get over it. In 1971, Wonder Woman in Grace. This problem, Wonder Woman become the cover of MS Magazine in United States. Damn, Gal Gadot. Completely intertwined. In 1975, Wonder Woman made a TV series that Linda played Dern. by yeah. Linda Carter. I mean, Linda Carter, not Laura Dern. What am I talking about? Who is a Linda Carter? Linda Carter is a the sexiest woman alive a for a 50-year-old songwriter. Woman born in 1961 wants the crown of Miss World 1972 and this achievement led him to be a cast on a legend Wonder Woman I'm sure you'll agree it's suitable act and Linda Carter still looks good today Linda Carter nose, blue eyes his face calm he's fantastic and he has an exotic skin. Wonder Woman has also a fighter. And a fighter in a real life rarely white. Damn! Damn! Wonder Woman entered the crisis of infinite. What is a crisis of infinite? Crisis infinite is a comic of DC. Oh, crisis infinite. In 19 and oh, that's what he was trying to say. To crisis on infinite Eighty-six. And the yeah, storytelling. English is not a second language. He's not his primary language. Crisis He's trying. He's trying. We all know. The crisis made a public panic. Crisis. And the old story always say the people who have the power to prevent it. Gorilla Grodd. I love that guy. After the Phantom for 35 years, Wonder Woman finally returned with the, the new 52. Of the comic book in More of a badass. World. Making it aim to attract young people 
interest in reading. Fakum, but doesn't mean retirement for Wonder Woman. <laughs> With the release of the new comic, the same year, Wonder Woman became EKN's top 100 superhero all the time. She is pretty up there. The author oh, was Leonardo the background of this achievement. But after a vacuum for 35 years, and then release the comic. You say a fucking f and the years? same year. I'm still right. I, his English is top oh, 100. I'm trying to understand, but I think he said a fucking so 100. Coincidence. Really? <laughs> In 2013, Wonder Woman looks in the book of Smallville. Smallville, a fictional village in the United States where the Superman was formed by a couple surnamed Ken. Oh, Smallville was a comic this book? This poor child, fortunately, there we pick up him. Thought this affectionate couple can be a superboy who has the soul of humble helpful and high-minded still haven't seen smallville yet gotta get on that after one year of smallville she also played in the movie the lego movie lego was a game little boy can be a part players and i have seen this movie I'm sure we have seen the film we like. It's my script, it's sell also children. And certainly the film is not heavy on the brain or sexy. Simple but entertaining. I'm sorry, the guy's children. trying, but it's kind of hard to understand I really, what he's trying really to say. I recommend it to be watched together with the family. My fellow master builders, Hello. Lord Business Plans to In 2070 2017 This Wonder Woman get a chance to make a live action This year, there is also a Justice League and a Wonder Woman to play in it And in 2019 2019 Justice Lead two project is be great. What you also must have felt that the years of 2011 until now, superhero more often played in the theater. I think it was a revival of the superhero comics after the torpor. Doctor Boy, okay, guys. The poem is for 75 years has accompanied as a Wonder Woman, but he never feel it. Reading for a comic TV series in collaboration with the other superheroes Damn, Gal and filmed in 2017 and, and make sure you watch it. Thank you for watching and the best for sincerity. Goodbye. I had a hard time trying to find, figure out what he was trying to say, but I got the basic gist of what he was trying to say, like trying to tell the history of Wonder Woman. I gotta look that up more often. But I saw Wonder Woman yesterday. It was amazing, surprisingly amazing. One thing that just came out of left field is like, you know, when Chris Pine and her were talking on the boat heading towards London. If uh, Wonder Woman knew anything about sex, and she goes like, "Yeah, I read all the books about it. It's like more of like a thing to get to kids and all that. It's not anything sexual pleasing or anything because the man doesn't please the woman." So basically, you think she says that, and then 20 minutes later, she wants the boat with Chris Pine for some reason. 
I was like, what the fuck? I thought you didn't get any sexual pleasure out of it. You just wanted to have kids. Or did I miss something? I don't know. Someone explain that to me. Because all of a sudden, a Wonder Woman got horny for some dick in that movie. I don't know why, but it just happened. But anyway, great movie. This guy, hard to understand, but pretty good video, though. Anyways, take it easy, Humanoid Nation. Humanoid Freak Out. Bye.